Hello everybody, I'm Mana. This is Maru. And we are back with more Baldur's Gate 3. When we last left off, we uh, kicked Balthazar's ass. And nearly died in the process. And now we're going to talk to this lovely lady, whose name I already forgot. She is the Night Song. I should speak up. Let's get right into it. has drawn his final rancid breath. <laughs> A pity it was not my hand that brought it about. Instead, it was you. You, who have come to seek the praise of your wicked goddess. You, who have come to drive a dagger through my heart. Not a dagger. A spear. My Lady Shah's spear. Her fate is mine to seal. Let me handle this. The fate you seal is your own. To be a dark justicia is to turn your heart from everything but loss. You will know no love, no joy, only servitude, until, of course, your mistress inevitably discards you. And there is much she does not tell you. A terrible blood price that may extend beyond my own death. You feel Shadowheart bristling. This is important to her. But your bond is strong. You may yet be able to sway her from the path of duty to the path of light. And Night Song is not blind to your conflict. Behind that raging heart is the restless beat of one who knows too well that her fate hangs in the balance. Is this what you truly want? I... Yes, I think so. I need you oh, to be sure. To no turning back now. I need you to be sure. Choose your own way. Cannot allow. This is my mistress's will, my life's purpose. Find a new purpose then. My mind is set. No, it's not. Your life is whatever you make it. Don't give up on yourself. Well, can't use guide. Oh, I just saw that number. I'm gonna need you to behave. It's not good enough. Fuck. If I have to step over your corpse to fulfill what Lady Shah asks of me, so be it. Your choice. You uh, don't make me fight her. This is wrong, but I can't afford to lose you. Do as you must. What's that I sense? A spear intended for my heart? Empowered by your goddess, I. Empowered to kill the child of a god. Do you know what I am, little assassin? For I know you. A lost child. Frightened by wolves in the dark. What did you say? Much has been promised to you, hasn't it? But what has been taken from you? What do you know of your own heart? Your own life? I sense more in you than you know. Whatever you think you know of me won't matter once I become who I'm meant to be. She knows something about you. Spare her and see what she has to say.
speak while you can. Oh! Don't worry, we can summon that back. It's fine. I... I can't believe I just did that. Lady Shaw will disown me. What will happen to me? Not what will happen. What will you do? Your past is not yet lost. Your future is not yet fixed. Lay a hand on me in friendship, not quite Sharon. And I will fight the battle that has been waiting for me this last century. Then, oh then, we will have much to discuss. You can do it. Our Shadowheart. Lady of Silver, hear me. She who guides the Moon Maiden Saluna, mother of the so-called Night Song. The Night Song is no more. Okay, so we technically killed the Night Song. Great gift, little warrior. Don't you find it also curious that you would spurn your dark lady? Perhaps you feel a staring of the truth already. But that will come later. There is a battle yet to be fought. You have done what we feared was impossible. You have released me from a century of sorrow. Your power is great. So too must be your weapon. You must choose what you will wield. And the Moon Maiden will provide. Thus I have said. Thus will it be so. Are you ready? Ready for what? To get out of this place? Absolutely. For my weapon? Naturally. Uh, ready for what? To kill Catherick Thorne. Okay, bye. We need to leave. Lady Shar won't stand for us to be here, not after what we did. If Shar is angry, she's being remarkably quiet about it. That's what frightens me. She must be angry. Yet, I don't feel it. Or hear it. There's only silence. Let's get out of here, please. Whatever's coming, I don't want to be in the heart of the Shadowfell when it finds me. The Night Song will be headed for Moonrise Towers. Hmm. We'd better get there and see what she's unleashed against Catherick Thorne. Can I fast travel? Probably not. Oh, okay, it's doing it for me. Thank you. Maybe. I hope I didn't fuck up the Grand Duke. Oh, I really hope I didn't fuck up the Grand Duke. Powerful ally. Well chosen, Shadow. 
Moonlight Catherine Blade. Is immortal no longer. He will know true death at our hands. Cannot travel from this end. Okay, that's fair. Um, real quick, before I forget to do it, because I picked it up. Boop! Moonlight Glaive. Beautiful. This object shines with a glowing light in a radius of six meters. Weapon enchantment plus two. Light. Permanent. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Seems simple enough. I'm dual wielding short bows. Cam cross bows, whatever. Ugh. There's going to be a soft bedroll in my near future. Forgive me. Shadowheart. What happened? You were missing for a moment. I... Oh, got it. I thought I was done for. I thought perhaps I might have been dead. This... This is all like some sort of terrible dream. But it's real, isn't it? I stood before the night song. I heard Lady Shah's words. And I failed her. Worse than failed her, I defied her. Just because of what that Asimar said. I tried to leave, but Shah blocked me. Punished me for failing her. I thought I knew the limit of pain that the incurable wound could inflict, but... I had no idea. It felt like I was suffering the agony of a thousand people all at once. My blood was boiling, my hair was on fire. I thought I'd claw my own face off with the pain. But then she released me. Banished me, more like. She said I was an outcast. That all of her children would know me and revile me. Shadowheart looks distraught. Abandoned by her goddess and all former allies. And as for her divine magic... Admitting who empowers her now may break her spirit for good. Major choice, now you'll have to live with it. We're all alone in the end unless you count the tadpole. If it's any consolation, I think you did the right thing. I never thought you'd actually defy Shar. What's going through? <laughs> um, if it's any consolation, I think you're doing the you right thing. You are lucky to have such confidence. Me. I think the full price of what I've done has yet to reveal itself. I'm a target to Lady Shah's followers now. Night Song promised she'd tell me something about myself. I need to speak with her as soon as I can. I understand. What she said to me back in the Shadowfell about the wolves. That's no coincidence. She took flight to hunt down Kethric Thorm. All I can do is help hasten his demise. And hope that answers soon follow. There's some matters I wanted to discuss. I'm sorry. It might be best kept until later. I'd be a poor counsel and worse company just now. How are you feeling? Do you really need to ask? No, but I thought I'd be polite and ask anyway. I'm sorry. I have a lot on my mind. The shadow fell. Night song. I can think of little else. The Night Song has some explaining yes. to do. I'm counting on it. I have little else to turn to. The sooner I speak to Night Song, the sooner I'll know what the future holds for me. Assuming I have a future at all. You will. If I have anything to do with it, you'll have a future. Alright, we're gonna go back to camp. No. Alright. Well. Need to find a way forward. What do we have to say about that? Shah's ire has shaken Shadow Hut. And yet she goes on. There is untold strength there, I feel.
I know there's probably a lot to be said now. Why are you still holding Shadow the crossbow? Heart suffers. You might be surprised, but it pains me to see. Now, what would you ask of me? In my years as the Blade, I've witnessed countless cruelties, faced unimaginable evil. But Thorn, he is made of pure hate. The Sword Coast will rejoice when the bastard's fallen. My father is somewhere in this tower. I okay, won't leave so him we in can Thorn's still hands. save him. Okay, good. good and good, good. lest we forget, we've a devil to rescue. Two missions. Right, I forgot about that one. One destination. Any idea where we'll find Duke Ravenguard now that we've reached the moon? Me <laughs> Not in any prison cell, certainly. My guess, Thorn will have confined him in the bowels of the tower. The deeper we dig, the closer we get. Hmm. I hate seeing Shadowheart suffer like this. All for doing the right thing. It's up to us to look after her now. If she needs a rest, we carry her. If she needs a hand, she has ours. If she needs ears, we've got four between us. Whatever she needs. I love you, Carlac. Hope you're keeping well, friend. Well, well enough. Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Huh? Who's a good boy? He's like, why? Why do you do this to me? Because you like to wake me up at six o'clock in the fucking morning. You smell very delicious, but I will not bite you. Thank you, dear. Bet. <gasps> More. You wanted something? I'm sorry. Okay, that's fair. It might be... I'll leave you be. Poor Shadowheart. The gods are nothing if not vindictive in their vengeance. Hi. Oh. I suppose it was only a matter of time until Shah took vengeance. For the Lady of Loss, she does not like losing. Yeah, it's a different kind of loss. Oh, darling, I'm hurt. I thought we had something special. Listen, 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 listen. I listen. guess I'll spend my evenings lounging here while well, you do all the hard work. It sounds awful. Listen. I need Will to come with me to save his father. Because that just seems like the right way to do it, okay? Okay. Shah called Shadowheart nothing. But I know better than that. She is something. She is worthy. She is strong. She is Shadowheart. Nothing can take the her from her. Not even a goddess. That's the spirit. That was very kind of you, Will. The fact that you had something to say twice makes you wonder if everyone else does, too. Hey, soldier. No, okay. Just Will. It's a Will thing. Got it. All right, let's... Let's end the day. Let's rest. What's up, Gail? Good evening. What? I'm here on behalf of Gail of Waterdeep. He wishes to extend you an invitation for a private conversation in a more suitable locale. Is 
You're not? You are speaking to a mere projection of... Yeah, I noticed. His appearance, his voice, and a certain measure of his personality, reconstituted in this case to play as emissary and usher. Would you care to join him? What little I could glean from the portion of his mind that is open to me, it is a matter most urgent. Very well. Gladly. Simply follow yonder path, and soon you will find him. Follow yonder path. You gestured that way. But there's nothing over here. What? Oh. I see. Um. Right. I forgot about... This isn't what I was talking about. So I must have to take a long rest first. Okay. I just wanted to make sure I was going to miss something. Like, I know it popped up automatically, but I'm, I'm always nervous about missing things. So... that away from the mic, sorry. <laughs> Didn't think about it. Well, magic I man. This time of night. There's an almost reverent silence that accompanies the peak of darkness when you'd almost believe the dawn will never break. The cradle of eternity. The timelessness of lovers. That most beautiful of fantasies. Breathtaking Gale, is this starry sky you're doing? You seem especially philosophical this evening. Are you alright? Why did you summon here? I'm afraid all of this is just fantasy. It's breathtaking. Indeed. You're breathtaking. The curse is still present, of course. Just... Veiled, and at arm's length for now. Not a trick I can repeat often, but tonight... Tonight is different. This may be my last night alive. I wanted it to be under a canopy of... Beauty and wonder. I thought this place might bring me peace. I thought it might make the weight of what I must do feel a little lighter. But I'm not so sure. Is this truly what you want? To die for the promise of mistress forgiveness? It's a heavy burden, yes, but one you're you're able for. Think of the good your sacrifice will do. Fuck that shit. You speak of as if this affects you alone. How many will die if you unleash what's inside of you? Are you not afraid? I refuse to believe this is the end. We'll find another way, I promise. Thank you. But even if we do find another way, perhaps this is the right way. The end fate wishes for me. I don't believe that. There is no point in running from the inevitable. Better to meet it on my own terms. 
Nothing is inevitable. Not when we face it together. You don't have to die. You sound sure of your course of action, then. You're right. At least this way you might make take the absolute down with you. Might. Why are you so sure it's inevitable? We haven't even found this heart of the absolute yet. Nothing's inevitable. Yes. But there is so much to live for and so few moments in which to house it all. Damn you. Damn you for giving me so much to care about. Our You're friends, welcome. our adventures. <laughs> this would have been so much easier if it was just me. But it isn't. If there is a way, any way, to save all that's grown dear to me, I want to seize it. I just cannot fathom what that might be, other than to fail Mistra and condemn the world. We'll find a way. Stay with me, will you? I don't want to think of it anymore, but I don't want to be alone either. Stay with him and watch the stars in silence. I mean, it is gorgeous. And I'm sure he put a lot of work into it. Meditation. Uh, oh, that poster did not go down well. Why are you two still standing there? There they go. I was hoping to speak to you, as a matter of fact. About the night you were kind enough to keep this melancholy wizard company. You mean last night? Go on. I wanted to... to thank you. I was sinking into a dark place. But you reminded me there is still light in the world, and I should care to look for it. You... You may well have prevented me from doing something very rash in the near future. I count myself lucky to call you a friend. You're goddamn right you do. The feeling is mutual. I'm glad to hear it. And I intend to prove myself worthy of the sentiment. All right, anybody else have anything to say? Everybody quiet? Okay. Boop. Wow, this got a lot smaller. To Moonrise Towers. All right, didn't say bye to Scratch and Owlbear Cup first. Holy fuck! <laughs> I'm gonna save real quick. What? <laughs> damn, my. Uh, yeah. Girl, you've been busy. Holy fuck, Nuggets. Uh, send to camp. Wow, um, just a pile of you guys. Don't mind me, just helping myself. Hell yeah! That key might be useful. That might be useful as well. Take that. It was Moonrise Guard. Okay, so I have multiple guard keys now, so. Thank you! I'm just touching everything. It's fine. Don't question it. Mm. 
Started a conversation. Oh. Was trying to loot, but you know, it is what it is. Unshackled from shadows. She will rise in moonlit glory and carve a path of brightness to the accursed one's second death. So saith the wise Alondo. That beacon of angelic wrath has taken the fight to Catherick on the rooftop. In the first line of defense, our dead. But storming the tower won't be easy. And if we wait too long, Catherick will gather his strength and retaliate. For now, though, He's on the back foot for the first time since he returned from the grave. This is it. The spearhead moment. You brought us this far. So how shall we proceed? We move in and secure the ground floor, floor first, cut off all exits. You're the High Harper, tell me. If you're hunting one target among many, the key is to isolate and corner it. My Harpers and I will be the noose that closes in around Keverick, and as it tightens, you will go in for the kill. Floric left some of her flaming fist. They'll scout the prisons and the barracks below to ensure we're not taken by surprise. Say the word, and we're off. Let's do this. In this light, there will be victory. In this light, we will avenge the fallen! <sighs> the time has come. Gather equal taste of death at last. You made it sound like you're going to eat him. Once more to save Baldur's Gate. Do I need more guard keys? Probably not. Am I gonna take them anyway? Yep. Hey, I almost didn't see this guy. No, nope. we can talk later. I wasn't trying to talk. I was trying to move. There. You dare show yourself here after all you've done. What you talking about? You have betrayed me. You have betrayed General Thorm. You have betrayed our God. And for what? These Harpers. Moonrise will be their tomb, and in death, you will all serve the Absolute. Step aside. Where's the fun in that? Boys, make this traitor bleed. Ah, a little fun at last. This might take a little bit.
Another day, another fight. Damn it. I, I should have done that first. Oh well, it's fine. Now, who's closest? You know what? Going in. This is a stupid thing for me to do, but I'm gonna do it. That way, you can get people in range. Jahira. Ooh. Oh my, you are. Oh, you're. <laughs> like a giant or something. It's just a guy who's standing on the fucking rafters. Oh god, that was funny. Oh. That's not what I wanted. That. Oh, that's right. Yours can. Mm, cloud of daggers. That's right. That's a thing you can do. Boop! Oh god! You good? Yeah, you good. do for now. Oh, I should have had her summon a sword or something. Did I not summon Scratch? Okay. Time to strike. How did you get all the way back here? Oh wait, no, you didn't. What? Really need to remember to use poison with her. Jahira. Why would you not attack what's directly in front of you? 
Nature will prevail. I didn't get to read the rest of it. So I can't put that on someone. But I can put that on you. gonna need him to move his cloud of daggers. going well. Okay, target's too far. Okay, so we'll just have to wait because I can't get the result not in range. can't get path is interrupted targets too far Well, 
shit. I need, I need the spirit guardians. Because they are helpful. I just want you to move forward. And get them in there in range. And you got multiple people with that. Good, 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 good. All right, it's not much, but it helps. That should have provoked an attack of opportunity. That's bullshit. done anything yet. Why can't I fucking fuck? Uh, we'll at least move you some. Is it not playing anymore? Is that... Fuck. Not enough movement. That's fine. You don't have a lot of warlock spells, you know that, right? Just moving a little further forward. I'll deal with you in a bit. I see you up here, and I will deal with- I, I see you guys up here, and I will deal with you momentarily.
I love that that heals the allies too. That's wonderful. You're mine. Bonk. Hey, good job. You're just making this harder on yourself. On hit, a coated weapon covers its target in oil for two turns. Oil cover targets immolate upon taking fire damage. Ah, that sounds dangerous. Death won't take me yet. Ooh, good job. Can't reach destination. Can I? Yeah, I didn't think I'd be able to reach that. It is what it is. Nope, not Jahira. There we go. Move you a little further forward. Well, maybe I shouldn't have moved you forward. Oh good, it is still singing. It wasn't sure. Okay, I guess it does tell me right there. I just... It's fine. You don't... I want to use it. Let me use it. Boop! Focus, strike your... <laughs> Ooh, what does it do? Oh, that's beautiful. Got to press on. We're going to dismiss you because you aren't anywhere near enemies currently. There's one more up there. Okay, never mind. Those are, are very much so done. I think you can take me on. Here gone. Can't 
taste my fury. Because that's the only enemy left, is the Warden. Oh, fuck, that just healed. Well, that means that's fine. Bitch, I see you. God, that's pretty. Detecting presence. And then there's Brielle, who can see invisibility. One day, I'll catch a break. Immune to fire damage. I was hoping that would make her seen. Actually, you know what? It's not. But I should be able to see her. Can't I see her? Like, like, Brielle should be able to see her. Do you have throwables? You have holy water. See if she moved. Okay. I was gonna say, if she's over here, the spirits will find her. Get in the way, bitch. <laughs> Told you. Parasite in that corpse, brimming with potent magic. Down. To do. Take, take the parasite. 
Angelic Reprie, Barb Darrow. Mm. You know what? We'll send send to camp. Spell Crux Amulet, Spell Slot Restoration. Ooh. I feel like Shadow. Patrol Earth. these floor, Harpers. Watch the doors and watch the windows. Nothing enters or exits these rooms alive. Boop. We're gonna backtrack, so. What's in here? Oh, I've checked those. Oh, I can turn off Demon Spirit Aura. Send that to Carlac. Ooh, Halberd of Vigilance. Gain a plus one bonus to initiative rolls and advantage on perception and ability checks. When you make an attack roll as a reaction, you make it with advantage. Ooh, send to camp. I will send it to camp. We'll send it to camp. And we'll read this. To whom it may concern. Krug got his head stuck in a butter barrel, and when his little imp thing tried to help him, they both fell off a ledge into a volcano. I laughed so hard that Zariel sent me out of the room. Other than that, you haven't missed much, though I've sure as hell missed you, XO Flo. Okay. Alt. Balthazar has sent neither word nor notice. Wherever he's gone is a mystery. Need someone to investigate his chambers, but no doubt he's rigged the thing to high hells. Perhaps hobgoblins. Thank you. Shield bash. When the foe hits you with a melee attack, you can use your reaction to knock. Sweet. We're gonna not do what I just did. Here you go, Will. Balthazar's room key. Sent to camp. Mind flare, parasite. Oh, it's a specimen. Hmm. Do I need a thousand of these guard keys? No. Am I taking them anyway, just in case? Whatever floats your canary, I guess. Ah. Oh, okay, you're one of us. Barnabas. Specimen. I don't want a specimen. You're just gonna keep running through there, aren't you? Okay, I'm going up. Can't give up now. Because I want the loot. Thank you. 
And thank you. Oh, damn it, I should have used the caustic bulbs. Why didn't I do... God damn it. I need to stop picking shit up because I fucking forget. Where are you going? As long as we hold this floor, the tower is ours. I'll stay here. Ensure no one comes up or down without a scimitar welcome. You're close now. A final audience with Ketherick Thorm awaits. Woohoo! I detect a hint of envy. Perhaps you'd like to be there for the fi for that <laughs> finale? Keen eye. I suppose I could be persuaded. Consider yourself persuaded. Fair enough. The time has come. Ketherick will taste of death at last. Fuck yeah! Okay, so I am going to call it here. And when we come back, we'll do our leveling. And we'll push on. And I like that I didn't have to remove anyone from my party. We'll also, you know, heal. And oh my god, 167 hit points, motherfucker! Share? Jesus. Anywho. Yeah. I'll see you guys next time. Until then, do something nice for a stranger today. You just might save a life. Bye!